basin for Christchurch was the catchphrase, and they did. 10,000 fans turned up to do their bit for the earthquake-ravaged province. The devastated city's mayor was there. So too the Prime Minister. There were the sports stars from all codes, as long as they knew how to hold a cricket bat. And the thespians, they turned out in large numbers with the cast of The Hobbit in attendance. The Basin Reserve, cricket, sunshine. The idea for such an event just had to come from a former Black Cap skipper. Stephen Fleming, you know, one of our cricketing legends, came into my office here at the Basin about a week and a half ago and he said, mate, I want to run a game. I want to fill the Basin and I want you to help me. Um, you're in Cricket Wellington and um, we, um, we said we needed a headline act. We got Shane Warne across the line pretty quickly. And look, here we are, you know, literally nine or ten days later with 10,000 Wellingtonians with the weather just sublime. So it's going to be a great day. Grew up there and, uh, and was devastated by what I saw. I introduced my family the day earlier to some of the great spots. Uh, and obviously friends and family, so it's a very close connection. Cricket is what I know and that um, being able to put something like this on in, in summer and, and call in some of the friendships that I've made over the years is, um, is wonderfully, wonderfully fulfilled. I just think on a human level, you know, you've seen the devastation that was caused by it and, you know, you'd be pretty hard-hearted not to kind of want to help in some way. The cricket action itself seemed unimportant on such a day, but there was some impressive action on the pitch. The Prime Minister had $100,000 hanging on his ability to hit a boundary off the bowling of Aussie bad boy Shane Warne. No problem, the money's in the bank. It's a great feeling. And uh, the base, is there anywhere else but the base and to play cricket in New Zealand? No. It looked like an amazing day, it really did. And obviously you've just seen Wellingtonians turned out in their droves for it. Uh, they're doing it again today. We're coming to you from Te Papa. If you are a Wellingtonian and you want to come down and show your support for Christchurch, then we welcome you with open arms. Absolutely. Come on down, Wellington, after the break. We're going to a break right now. We're going to meet one of our many heroes down in Christchurch.